thank you all for coming today. And isn't this a very exciting day for our franchise? Um, welcome to the Carthon family and friends, and we're glad to have you here with us to join in the excitement, but welcome. And before we bring up the man of the hour, you ran, let me first say a bit about the search process that brought us to today. When we started back in December, it was important to me that we define exactly what we were looking for in a new GM and that we cast a wide net for people to talk to. We were fortunate that our process included several extremely talented candidates, all with impressive backgrounds and experiences, and I want to thank them all for their time and interest in us. And in particular, I'd like to thank Monty Ossenfort and Ryan Cowden. Congratulations to Monty on his new position with the Cardinals. I enjoyed getting to know Monty during his time in Nashville, and I'm thrilled for him and his family. I also want to express my appreciation to Ryan Cowden for his work over the years and for his tremendous leadership of the personnel team over the past six weeks. Ryan is a great leader and football evaluator, and no doubt he will one day soon be an outstanding general manager. But in the end, Rand stood out as a clear choice as the next general manager of the Titans for a few reasons. He's a former player who grew up around the game. He has strong record of success in evaluating talent and roster building at multiple teams. And really what impressed me the most was his growth mindset, clear vision, and ability to connect with people. We called as many potential references as we could find to learn more about Rand as a person, talent evaluator, and leader. Whether current and former colleagues, the scouting community, the former teammates, the feedback was unanimous. Rand is exceptional. As a talent evaluator, Rand brings tremendous skill set to the process, and he is a natural leader and collaborator. I'm excited for Rand and his staff to work closely with Coach Frabel and the coaches to align on a vision for the team and to build a roster of players who best fit that vision. Together, they will identify talented players and ultimately the right players to build a championship roster. Despite how last season ended, I still have high expectations for our team. We have some big questions to answer off season, but I'm excited for what the future brings. With that, I would like to introduce and welcome Rand Carthon as the Tennessee Titans general manager. Good afternoon. Uh, thank you everybody for being here. Um, man, this is an exciting time. Uh, dream come true. Uh, something my wife and I, we've talked about and something, uh, you know, just been a vision of mine since I was a little kid. Um, I'm grateful and thankful for the opportunity uh, that these people on this front row have given me um, and I wouldn't be here without them. Um, my introduction to this group uh, started uh, back in, I guess, about three weeks ago uh, in Dallas, where I w uh, met Miss Amy, I met Burke, and I met Adolfo um, at the NFL Accelerator Program. Uh, and it was through that program where we had our first initial uh, conversation, and I left from that conversation uh, feeling great about this organization. And once I got the call to interview here for the GM job, I knew that this was a place I wanted to be. And I'm not sure if everybody saw uh, that welcome uh, yesterday, but that shows how special uh, this place is and how special this place is going to be. Um, I didn't get here alone. Um, I had a lot of help uh, throughout the years, and I want to say a few thank yous uh, to those people. Uh, I got my start in Atlanta um, under the Falcons, under the tutelage of uh, Thomas Dimitrov. So I want to thank Arthur Blank. I want to thank um, Thomas Dimitrov, Les Sneed, uh, who was then the pro director um, at the time, and I worked under him. And uh, through Les, he brought me to St. Louis uh, with him as a director and gave me my first director job. And so the people at the uh, Rams uh, who played a big part in my growth uh, in getting to this spot, you know, so uh, Mr. Kroenke, um, who's the owner, uh, Kevin Demoff, and all the great coaches uh, and players that we've had there, the 
outpour from players that I've received, uh, both current and former, uh, has been amazing um, and made me just confirmed, you know, how important it is to establish those relationships with those guys. Uh, last but not least, um, from a from a professional standpoint, you know, I want to thank the San Francisco 49ers organization. Um, we've had a great six-year run, um, and it's continuing uh, this uh, this week. Uh, so I want to wish those guys plenty of luck. I'll be there to root them on. Uh, but I want to thank the York family. I want to thank Dr. York, uh, Jed, Miss Denise, uh, Jenna and Mara, uh, and the late Tony, uh, who all played a part in establishing that organization as a first-class organization. Um, I also want to thank John Lynch, um, who hired me there, um, who is one of the most uh, exceptional leaders that I've ever been around. Um, and also uh, Parag Marate. Um, Parag has become a mentor of mine. Um, he took me under his wing and showed me and shared with me an aspect of the game that I had uh, no idea of. And then finally, um, I want to thank, you know, these beautiful people on the front row. You know, I want to thank my children. Um, it's been a lot of sacrifice, you know, throughout the years. Um, you know, you guys have gone to multiple schools and you guys have uprooted your lives so I can live my dream. Uh, so I'll be forever indebted. Uh, to you guys, and I love you. Um, and then finally, my wife. Um, we have, we've been together 20 years now, and she brought up uh, the point, uh, it was the spring semester of uh, 2003, and she asked me, what did I want to do outside of playing football? Um, and I told her, I was like, I one day I want to be a GM of the NFL football team. She later told me she almost stopped dating me because she never met somebody that lived in La La Land, but, <laughs> But, honey, today that dream comes true, and we're uh, realizing the, you know, that, that work that we've put in. Thank you for being my rock. Um, thank you for being the stabilizer of our family, and thank you for being the CEO, CFO, COO, and all things to our family. I'm not here without you, so thank you, and I love you. And that's it for me. Thank you all. I would probably add accountant to that as well. Um, on behalf of the uh, football staff, the staff downstairs, the training room, the, everybody that, that Rand has uh, had a chance to meet or, or will meet, uh, we want to welcome you, Rand, your family, your beautiful family. Um, I can't wait to get to, to work with you, to meet them. We're going to go play in the bubble after this too, I promise you that, okay? Um, you know, throughout this process, um, re really appreciated where everything went uh, with Amy and, you know, the organization and Burke and Kenneth and Barkley, um, the conversations that I had with Rand that, that would run um, countless hours that seemed like they lasted 15 minutes. Um, that was a, a really good indication of, of where our comfort level was with each other. And uh, excited, extremely excited. We, get, we got a lot of work to do, and we're excited to get to, to work on that. We have this morning, uh, we will, uh, as he continues to get settled uh, with his staff, um, that, that's in place. Uh, the coaches, I know that that's important. We, we've tried to talk about our staffs and, and where we see that going and you know, how they can help us evaluate the right, right type of players for this organization uh, and what we believe is important and, and the players that we have in place that, that have been our foundation for the last you know, five years that I've been here and the ones that, that help us get through uh, the difficult times. And you know, I, wanna, I wanna welcome him. Um, and I'm excited to get to work with him. Uh, I know our coaches, when they get back here, you know, are gonna love every opportunity that we can with him and his staff. So welcome on behalf of the coaching staff, the players, our, everyone downstairs uh, that you will meet um, here in the next couple weeks. Um, and and this, this is your day. You've earned it, you've deserved it. Um, so I want you to get up here and, and answer these questions, okay? Welcome. <laughs>